Are you looking for the best scouts in Football Manager 2024 to turn your scouting from mediocre to the best in the world? Then look no further than this video. You're probably wondering what makes a good scout and how can I find these great scouts that you're going to recommend. Well, I'm now going to show you what makes a good scout and how to find them. So let's kick it off. What actually makes a good scout? Well, there are three attributes and in my opinion, the first two are the most important. I'm going to use Gerardo Guzman here as an example of that. So the first two that I always look for in a good scout is judging players' ability and judging players' potential. You want them as high as 20 as possible. 20 and 20 in both if you can, but anywhere near 19 and 20 and upwards is going to be very, very good. This means they're going to be able to accurately predict how good the current player is in terms of your team. So it, are you scouting a player that is better than what you need or is he going to be coming in as a squad player or is he worse than you actually want and they say you know listen look don't bother going out and buying him and then the potential one is the big one as well how good can this player be we all know we all love to scout wonder kids and if you've got closest to 20 they're going to be able to accurately predict with the right training and the right club atmosphere how good this player is going to be for your squad the third thing to take into account is adaptability now, if you're asking someone to move country and come into a new squad and all that kind of stuff, this does play into it. But for me, I don't think it has that much of an impact. Others may argue more. But for me, the, the two key stats, for me personally, are the ability and judging players' potential. That's how you judge a good scout. So how do you find these amazing scouts? So once you're in the game, you want to click on staff. Once you click on staff, click on staff search, and it will bring you up with a screen like this. Now, what you want to do is just filter your search. So click on edit search brings up the screen like this you want to click on staff role make sure you've got scout ticked in they are in the recruitment team section so you click on scout this why you click on scout is because you're then more likely to accept a role as a scout at your club then if you click on coach with that someone's got great great things like this but they want to be a coach it's going to be tricky to negotiate them to come to your club now what you want to do is pick your attributes like i just did there click judging players ability and potential as i've just explained these are the two most important ones and you want to make them as close to 20 as possible i recommend start off with 19 and then working your way down or you can go up to 20 and do the same thing it is just complete preference that's just the way i do it and it will bring you up with a list like this and i'm going to go through now my top recommendations for scouts for fm24 my first go-to scout is always Northern Irishman, Jim Lawler. He is unbelievable. He's been chief scout at Man United for a very, very long time, almost 20 years. He's got 20 judging players' ability and 20 judging players' potential with 15 adaptability as well. He should be the first man you get. Another Man United man in Jose Mayorga. He's got 20 and 20 and only 9 adaptability. So you've got to be careful with that. You try and want to get the adaptability as high as you can. But judging player ability and potential, in my opinion, is much, much better. So I would still go and get Jose Mayorga. He's a very, very good scout, and he's very good at discovering South American wonder kids. I've always had him on my saves. He always finds gems. He is a top pick. Ricardo Peccini is another man I always go for. He has been chief scout at places like Sampdoria, director of football at Monaco, and head of youth development at AC Milan as well. 20 and 20. 13 adaptability, you can't go wrong with this Italian. 48 years of age, so he's going to be in your staff for a long time, and he is always discovering great players. A short-time option for a scout is Aurelio Pereira. The 75-year-old Portuguese is one of Sporting's best scouts and is one of the best scouts in the game, although he does retire normally after you get him. So, like I said, use him as best as you can for a season or two, and he will provide you with absolute quality gems. You, he does not miss a hit. Inter Milan scout Claudio Scolosa is next with 19 judging player ability and 19 judging player potential. Nine adaptability as well. This man is one of your go-tos to beef up your scouting team. He should be on top of your list to get. He won't cost you a lot. He's on decent money, so you can probably get him for 3 or 4k a week. If you're a big club like a Manchester City, PSG or any big club around Europe, you'll be able to poach him. Go and get him because Inter Milan are always finding gems. Another Portuguese recommendation is Jorge Gomez. The scout has worked at Benfica and at Porto as a director in the early 90s. He's got 19 and 19 with 13 adaptability. He's got great knowledge around the world. He's going to be bringing you South American wonder kids as well as those Portuguese wonder kids as well. And we all know the best new gens or regens, whatever you want to call them, do come from South America undisputedly. Giuseppe Pompillo is the man who is famed for bringing Oshimen to Napoli. He's brought an unbelievable striker there. And for me, 
This guy is one of the best scouts on the game. He has 17 adaptability, 19 judging players ability, and 19 judging potential as well. This man's found absolute quality ballers. Look at that Napoli squad that won Serie A last year. This is the man that's responsible for it. And if you want to win and build a team like that, then you need this man in your scouting team. To finish it off, my last recommendation is Marcus Pietler, the chief scout currently at Bayern Munich. He's worked at Borussia Dortmund before, and he is the man responsible for getting players like Bellingham, Sancho, Bygon, Bino Gittins, all those players, Rice, any, any Dortmund player you can name in the last 10 years is coming from this man. He is the main man in Germany for scouting talents. He's got 20 judging a player's ability, 20 judging player's potential. He is, if you can get him from Bayern, you need this man in your staff. And if you love staff recommendation videos, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel.